I'm Mark Kelly and Mr. Saltwater Tank coming to you on behalf of saltwateraquarium.com. Last week we revealed that we're using both the Neptune System Skylight and the Ecotank Marine Radion over the saltwateraquarium.com 700 lobby tank. Now if you want to understand why we went with both lights, the link to that show is right up there. This week we're going to dive into the similarities and the differences between the two lights. Both of these fixtures use LEDs to produce light and both of them take the panel approach to the LED diode placement. That means they spread the LEDs out over a rectangular area versus over a puck type of design. The sky spreads out its 104 LEDs over a greater area than the 102 LEDs of the Ecotech Radeon G5. Note that on the Neptune system sky, the diffuser is built in. If you want to add a diffuser to the Radeon, it's an add-on that magnetically attaches to the light. One big selling point of LEDs is their controllability and both Ecotech Marine Radeon G5 and the Neptune System Sky had different ways that you control them. Most basic control is done through touch buttons on the top of the fixture. The Radeon has three touch buttons, two for changing light intensity and one for changing color temperature. The Neptune System Sky has a single button that you can change both the color temperature and the light intensity. Beyond the touch buttons on the top of the fixtures, this is where the controllability of the fixture starts to diverge. The Radeon is only controlled wirelessly through Ecotech's Mobius app. The Neptune System Sky can be controlled wirelessly or wired through a separate connection. The cord from the Sky gets split into two different types of connections. One connection is the Aquabus cable, the other is a proprietary connector. OCD types that think the cord wrangling is a must have will lament another cord to wrangle, and I feel you on that one. Not the end of the world, just something worth noting. These days, we're doing just about everything on a smart device, like a smartphone or a tablet. And sometimes it's nice to use a computer with a web interface, especially when you want to program things. Now, the Ecotech Marine Radeon doesn't give us a web interface, as Mobius is only available on a smart device. The Neptune System Sky does give us a web interface through Apex Fusion. Give and take here, whatever your personal preference, just note the differences. The saltwateraquarium.com 700 is a 30-inch deep tank, so we started the intensity at 50% and took PAR readings for each light. And if you really want to blow things out, here's the PAR readings at 100% intensity. Both Ecotech Marine Radeon G5 and the Neptune System Sky have things we like and things that we would like to see done differently. And none of the things in the like to see done differently category are things that make us not recommend the light. We'd also be lying if we told you that both of these lights are perfect. Like most things in life, there's a give and there's a take. I'm Mark Callen, Mr. Saltwater Tank, coming to you on behalf of saltwateraquarium.com. Till next time, enjoy your tanks, and I'll catch you in the next episode. Mm -hmm.